This is Chicago's very own WGN Saturday Evening News. During the pandemic, you may want some company. The Anti-Cruelty Society is doing virtual adoptions. It's a great way to find a pet without the risk of exposing yourself to the virus. WGN's Marcella Raymond tells us how to do it. I am telling you, the cuteness factor is like through the roof. Watch out. The kittens are on the loose. Take one out real quick. Yes, check out time. Oh, no, all of you want to come out. Not one, but all four siblings made a run for it. And really, honestly, if I worked here, oh! <laughs> they are all up for adoption. So are these siblings, who are a little less rambunctious and may need some extra love. They were found in a park by a Good Samaritan. They were actually tied up in a plastic bag. But they're much better now. About 200 animals are up for adoption at the Anti Cruelty Society. Because of COVID 19, all pets are now adopted virtually. You can even set up video conferences with them and their foster parent. I mean, they talk to the pet and video conferencing? That's right. They talk to the pet, right? They ask the animal questions. What kind of bedding do you like? Of course, there are dogs, too, like Diamond. And unlike the kittens that can't keep still, Diamond just rolled over and posed for the camera. The virtual adoptions have been a hit. It has been wildly successful, and people are so happy on both sides. During this shelter in place, Rosie and Theodore have bonded so much that they can only be adopted together. Since Rosie came into the room, the two of them have bonded. So now we're looking for a home for both of them together because they've literally fallen in love with each other. Oh, it's a COVID love story. Yeah. Even cats can find love during a pandemic. Reporting from River North, Marcella Raymond, WGN News.